Yo, Major Slack here. How y'all doing? So, here we are at the beginning of Act 2 of Far Cry 2. Here we go. Let's do it to it. And I'm at a weapon shop uh, right at the northwest corner of Act 2. And uh, we got to get into Cephapane. We got to get into town. Cephapane and hook up with Voorhees. I think that's how you pronounce it. So yeah, got a guard post to deal with on the way and that's it. So, let's do it to it. I think the best way to deal with this guard post is to take... It's just right down this down the road there, right there. And I think the best way to deal with it is just go up here, take the high ground, as usual. Best way to deal with any enemy position. This is a six-man guard post, if I recall correctly. Well, boys, here I am, all by my lonesome. Ain't nobody gonna know. Six of you boys against me. Kill me. No? No takers? I shit on all of you. Sufficiently shat upon. Let's go in and clean up. Equip close combat weapon. And there's that patrol, he didn't even notice. <laughs> oh, we got some action. Get them, get them, get them, get them, get them. There we go. You trying to run me over? Seriously, dude. Bad manners. Bad. Bad boy. Oh, you need some help? Here. There we go. Oh, yeah. Thanks for the ride, by the way. <laughs> okay, so. What kind of guard post is this? It's an ammo pile guard post. Alright. So that's it. Um, got to get to town. Nothing else on the way. So let's take the sweetest ride, which is this Jeep Liberty over here. And away we go. Now, the deal is there's a couple of opening missions in Act 2. This is to kind of like acclimatize you to what's going on in Act 2. They're pretty rough. One is the barge mission. You have to escort a barge across the lake. And another one is uh, you have to go down to the marina and protect the buddy. Both of them are pretty rocking. Really test you. So, um... In this batch of videos, I'll try to do both those missions. See how long it goes. So here we are in Cephapane. Oops. Back up a bit here. Yeah, right about there. And there's some diamonds in town. Right up there in that that steeple there. Anyways, we'll get him later. First, let's go talk Fine to this guy here. Right. 
Yeah. Also brought along the scribbling sheets they gave me. Never mind. All I think right. I just saw All right, Voorhees. What's up? Good. You made it. And Tuas is dead. So now the question is, what's our next move? But yeah, Bastion, you came back up and left the country. That's right. I spent ten years eating most of those boys in Angola, and look how they had to pay me. We're on our own, China. Only way any of us are going to make it is if we plan ahead. Okay. I've been thinking about it. There's a good chance the warlords in Barsik will decide to join forces, in the conflict for a while. That'd be that nice. Happens, soldiers like you and I are fucked. The men in charge always manage to get by. It's the foot soldiers that get lined up against the wall and shot, every time. So, we're gonna keep that from happening. Turns out your friend the Jackal's got a huge stockpile of weapons hidden on an island near Port Saleo. We're going to bring them into the city, give them to all the locals, and under an APR flag too. I reckon that'll force my boss to get his head back in the game. Let's get things started up again. Let's face it, Put. We need the business. I've got a captain to handle the boat. Now I just need someone I can trust to escort the goods. How about it? You interested? I can get you a meeting with the big man, Adi Mbantue. All you have to do is make your way to Lay Sekolo. The island's called Sekhlala something. Good grief. What a completely fucked up mission. Y okay, this is the deal. You want me to escort this barge full of weapons into town so that we can keep the war going like that's that's what i'm doing keeping the war going instead of like letting the faction leaders come to some kind of peace agreement jeez and you're paying me how much for this 20 diamonds well dip me in goat shit and color me scumbag <laughs> well 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 Do I need meds? No, I don't need meds. Okay, oh, I do need meds. Okay, so that's the deal. We have to escort this barge full of weapons across the lake so that the two faction leaders will think that, you know, they'll blame each other and, you know, get all pissed off and the war will keep going. And then, like, mercenaries like me and others will still have a job. <laughs> Jeez. Okay. Ain't more hell. Okay, so here's how you get these diamonds here. Go in here, climb up the ladder. Go to the very top. It's a lot of trouble for one diamond, but hey. Every bit counts. And yeah, I know I have a whole shitload of diamonds. <laughs> I did all the assassination missions at the end of Act 1. I haven't really really done any shopping yet. There's nothing I really want to buy. Except maybe the Uzi. Maybe a couple of repair upgrades and whatnot. Anyways, we'll see you later. Okay, so we got the diamonds. And now, where do we have to go? We have to go to basically the this island out in the middle of that lake there. And, um... Hmm. I don't know what time it is. It's about 4.30. Yeah, this mission, this barge mission is best done in the day. Definitely. And if I take the bus there, see, the best, the most logical way to get there would be to just go to that bus station up there and then take the bus to town and then drive across the lake there. But uh, I think that's going to put me around right around dusk and that's going to give me poor visibility. I don't want that. So, um, I think I'm going to take the boat all the way there. It'll take a little longer, but it will put me, give me very good light in which to accomplish this barge mission, which is a real son of a bitch. Real son of a bitch, you'll see. <laughs> the thing about the barge mission is uh, a couple of real. Uh, trouble spots in that mission. One is the rocket launcher guy and the other one is the mortar guy. And they're both slamming away at you with their ro with rockets and mortars giving you a real hard time. What you gotta do is you gotta take out those guys right away. And that's how you can complete the barge mission without too much problems. Basically all the swamp boats swarming around the, the barge no problem. You just blow them away with the rocket launcher. But it's those 
It's that guy with the rocket launcher way off in the distance and the guy with the mortar. You gotta take care of those guys, take them down, and then the barge mission is pretty much a cakewalk. So, into town we go. And there's an unlocked safe house on the way. Do I need anything? I don't think so. I have ammo. I have meds. No, so just keep going. <laughs>